cunts, today the gym is really packed. So, we're probably going to, I don't know if you know what we're going to do now. Just get ice for fucking Christmas nowadays, don't they? <laughs>
actually way too light. Bro. like there's editing which is sometimes like you know I'm, i feel like i'm kind of good at or i try my best to be for you guys but yeah, at this point like i'm so sick of it i like making content man. um but there's i think come a point where people think i bodybuild for social media and i need to make it really clear that the goal is so much more bigger um this is a joke but you know you didn't think that um also just uh pretty tired from training in general like it's sucking a lot out of me i've made pretty so you look at episode one and then look at the episodes i've been releasing i'm not saying i'm big now but you've seen the progress i've made 
I've been training hard, man. I've been trying to tick every single box. I've been really, I could be doing better, but I've been really putting in the work. Again, I could be doing better. Everyone can always be doing better. Um, hopefully, there'll come a time in life where I can't say that to myself and I can't say, no, I could have done more. Um, then, you know, that's kind of where I've done, I've left all the cards on the table. There's nothing left, there's no work left to be done, but you know, I've been cutting, uh, I feel like I'm clearly leaner, but bigger, put on way more muscle in my opinion, I'm getting way stronger, um, and it feels good because it's kind of all I want to do, uh, you know, I work lots of jobs, I do lots of labour, and just all these jobs at different cafes and pubs and restaurants, but like, all, every, all the time, every second I'm doing other jobs and other stuff, I'm just thinking about bodybuilding, thinking about the next meal, or you know, the next lift, well, there's so much intention behind everything now, I'm so early on in the game, I hope people just realise like, I really am trying to take this to the next level, in terms of, uh, well just seeing how far I can push my body, I know steroids is now involved in st uh, in bodyboarding, people take a lot of steroids, um, that's kind of scary, I don't know if I'm ready to do that, um, and I won't be ready for another 5, 6, 7 years, um, a lot of the greats took it when they were my age, though, at 18 years old, 19 years old. So it's kind of scary. A lot of my friends are saying, you know, you really want to be the Olympia, man. Better start thinking about hopping on. It's like, <laughs> I just don't feel like I'm ready yet. Um, I feel like I've got a long way to go. Everyone thinks I already look like I take steroids, but I don't know what they're seeing because these videos, the photos, the training videos I release, you know, I just I look back at them and I'm like, bro, for so much worse, you look like shit, like genuine shit, and that's an overstatement, like, I look so bad, and I know it's body dysmorphia, and oh no, you look great Marcus, it's okay, your, your pecs are so big and juicy, it's amazing, and all the girls saying that stuff in my DMs, but I'll be so real with you, that's your opinion, I appreciate you, you know, tooting my horn, but I don't, I don't agree with you, I think I look like ass, bro, um, so, there is a lot of mileage to be done on this physique in terms of lifting more weights. Um, Thanks for watching. You didn't want to close her up? Okay. Damn. <laughs>